Hello. Hello, is me. Hi, my name is Kiri Amdor. And I'm Nolan Peters, and we are juniors from Abraham Lincoln High School. Four score and seven years ago! Hi, my name is Nolan Peters, and I... Had a crush on Beverly for two years, and yet set a cooler guy to ask her out. All right, listen here, bucko. This is my... Our... Poem. poem. Yeah, it's true. This poem is about, like, a fourth grade crush, so it really doesn't mean anything. Fifth grade crush, so it means everything. <laughs> Dark. Dusty. Bleach smelling. Elementary, elementary school. school. I had the crush to end all crushes. One that grabbed me by the hair and whipped all reason out of me. And replaced reason with me, his best friend. But not quite yet. Picture this. Me and Nolan hadn't even met yet. In fifth grade, you go through mm, too much. Your, my voice went from this to this, settled somewhere in here, and I grew hair everywhere. And I noticed <laughs> girls. One of those girls that I noticed was Beverly. She was the most beautiful person my fifth grade eyes had ever seen. Her hair smelled like the sweet coconuts of the coast, and her eyes were like clusters of galaxies in the universe of my heart. Yeah, so her eyes smelled like the beach and her hair sparkled like the sun. Got anything else, Casanova? Uh, yes I have more. I could stand on this stage and profess my undying love for this magnificent being for hours. But yeah, for now that's it. We should talk about how you had it so bad for this girl that he couldn't even talk to her. I don't know if we should do Nolan that. had it so bad for this girl that he couldn't even talk to her. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't talk to her. Dorky dork fifth grade guy. I just made a custom Lego figurine out of her instead. Which was actually just a pre-made one we named after her. She was a vampire. I don't think we want to get into it. <laughs> Plus, despite his qualms of love and his amazing Lego figure, this man didn't talk to her for like four years and then sent ultimately cooler guy to ask her out. Ultimately cooler guy? It's JJ? Yeah, he is ultimately cooler. 2011, back to school night, class roster, my mother of all, point, of all people pointed out to me that the woman of my dreams was in my class this year. Me too. I was in that class. Oh, believe me, I couldn't forget because I got put in a group with you instead of the lady of my heart. I remember. We bonded thanks to some blue thunderbolts and our really stupid sense of humor. You wouldn't believe how funny pizza and hot dogs could be in the same sentence. Or a singular brick in the game of I Spy. Or JFK! JFK. You know, nobody out here is going to understand any of these jokes, but that's fine. They all have jokes with their best friends, too. And we've been best friends for a long time. Six years is decent enough, I think. And now that I think about it, we haven't really talked about Beverly much in this poem. Beverly kind of sucks now, but <laughs> we're still hanging out together. Maybe this poem isn't about Beverly. Maybe, Maybe it's, it's about... about... <gasps> JFK! <laughs>